Following a delicious breakfast at one of our local restaurants, why not start the day at the base of one of only two statues in all of America that was dedicated to both the North and the South, with many soldiers' names listed? While you're there, only feet away, you can also visit an impressive military display containing the names of many soldiers who served our county with distinction throughout the years. While in the city, this would be a great time to begin a self-guided tour of our 13 historical markers that are located throughout the county, with several in the city itself. These Kentucky historical markers describe the people and events which helped shape our county, commonwealth, and nation. Just don't get so wrapped up in the route that you miss a chance to meet the people along the way. Butler County has the distinct honor of operating two free-of-charge ferries with help from the Commonwealth. Depending on river levels, you can cross at Reed's Landing, enjoy a drive through the county side, then cross again on another ferry at the Rochester Landing, or the other way around. Have you ever wondered who taught Bill Monroe, the father of bluegrass music, how to play? The Bell Street Cemetery located in Morgantown contains a monument dedicated to the gentleman who, by Mr. Monroe's own account, served as a catalyst to the style that became bluegrass. Mr. Schultz may have just put the blues in bluegrass. Saving our two signature attractions for last, the weekend of July 4, 2017 marked the 37th annual hosting of the Green River Catfish Festival, which has been a staple in Butler County since 1981. The anchor attraction for the county continues to be the Green River Museum on the grounds of the Butler County Park at Woodbury. With new exhibits added yearly, the museum offers a self-guided look into the river life that made Butler County what it is today. While at Woodbury, you can also take advantage of the boat ramp or a newly constructed kayak slip to explore the Green River. We understand if all these ideas are too much to handle in a single day, so why not stay the night at one of our lodges? We offer the Morgantown Inn, the Green River Lodge, and the Woodbury Lodge Bed and Breakfast. With three towns, Woodbury, Rochester, and Morgantown, all connected by a single thread, the Green River, we just may be the embodiment of lines from the famous Robert Frost poem. Two roads diverged in a yellow wood, and I, I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference. <laughs>